Hey, you want to be gamer here with another top war hero spotlight today we're going to be talking about an air force hero hawkeye dante we'll be going over some of his strengths weaknesses uses pairings and the fact that he can make an entire army turn tail and run just by staring into his eyes and who i'm determined to prove is holding a water gun but we'll go ahead and take a look at his bio and see that he is a poet and a philosopher who believes war is a continuation of his poetry and that you should definitely fear this psychopath now i am a fan of his ability it does have two parts the first part is it increases the attack of air force units by up to 50.2 percent and their hp by up to 24.1 percent so definitely not a bad boost but the second part of his ability is what really makes him stand out and that is if he's on defense this boost applies to all types of units so air force navy and army and that goes into his strengths and his strengths, of course, would be his defense, being able to apply to all types of units, giving him the flexibility to change your base the way you want. It's definitely a, a great asset to have this guy on your defense. Now, that goes, of course, into his weakness. If he's great on defense, generally, they're a little bit weaker on offense. And while his ability is decent for Air Force on offense, it only applies to Air Force. And most people are crawling with tanks. There's just so many dang tanks out there, so he's not a great offensive hero because, of course, tanks are going to take down your Air Force. So definitely want to keep that in mind. Keep this guy on the defense. You never want to send him out on attacks. It's not your best bet. Now, as far as his uses, while he's on defense, it's nice to be able to mix up different types of units since his ability applies to all types of units. You can do an interesting defense where you have some sort of combination of two or three types, such as, you know, maybe Army and Navy, or maybe you've got Navy and Air Force, maybe you've got all three. So something that makes it a little bit harder for your opponents to get through your defense because they can't just say, oh, he's defending with Navy, let's just send in an Air Force. And that goes into what he pairs well with. Now, Dante pairs very well with Gonzo. His ability only applies when he's on defense, and it gives his Navy a big boost. And he also applies very well to an army hero, Bell, who also has an ability that is boosted when she's on defense. And the great thing about Dante is he pairs well with these guys because his ability applies to all types of units. So Gonzo's Navy, where Bell is Army, but Dante has the flexibility and his ability to be able to be paired e with either one of them very well. So definitely some great heroes to have on your defense. I'm a big fan of him. He's available in packs at the moment. You can't get him through premium recruiting. So far, I've only seen him available in packs. I highly recommend him. And Please let me know in the comments below who you'd like to see a hero spotlight on. Let me know some future videos. Don't forget to leave a like and subscribe and have a fantastic day.